Hi everyone, my name is Sandra. Welcome back to my channel. This is my fourth bullet journal flip through. And of course, this is an Archer and Olive. This was my first time testing this out. And uh, to this day, I still have a feeling of nausea every time I touch this journal. And if you haven't heard this story yet from my channel, the reason is because I was expecting my daughter Danica when I started this journal, I think I got pregnant in July, and I was getting really, really nauseous all throughout uh, September and October. So basically, this is why um, I have a huge, a huge aversion to this journal. So we're going to get started without further ado. Volume 4. As usual, I've covered up all of the personal private information, including... Um, anything to do with financials and dream log, weight log, anything that I don't want to be shared with the world. And because this journal only has 160 pages, I actually ended up moving from dailies to um, going back to weekly spreads in this journal. As you can see by some of these spreads here. So I did do Dutch door spreads because it did give me more room, but um, 
in these journals, like especially the A5 size, I am not a fan of weekly setups because it just doesn't give me enough room to write out my list to do. And um, as a mom of two and a busy YouTuber, I don't really have enough room in the small boxes. Like this isn't enough room for me right now. So um, I'm glad that I have an Archer and Olive B5 for my next journal. But that is it for this journal. I hope you guys enjoyed that quick flip through. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Also, if you're new here, I'd love if you subscribed. And don't forget to click the bell notification so you will be notified the next time I upload a video. I'll talk to you guys again soon. Bye now.